So, our first version of the graph rules are up and running. I'm going to demo, demonstrate it really fast uh, what you can do with it. So, I'm going into the graph tab over here. I'm going to start with adding a very simple graph rule. I want to check that all my toilets are more than two square meters, as an example. Immediately, you can see that some apartment turns red. That indicates that there's a problem within these apartments. And if I hover the graph here, I can see that this particular node is not big enough. And there's two ways to fix this. Either, of course, you can just go into a model like this, make it bigger, <clears throat> then you can see it updates, and this apartment is not red anymore. Or you could, of course, just also delete this apartment and let Finch present you with a new option. And here you can see present, uh, Finch presenting me with a lot of options. Of course, I can choose the same plan that I had a problem with since it comes from my own plan library, or I can investigate another or try other ones out here. Or I can go down and see what Finch presents to me here down in these results as well. But I'm going to choose this one, assign it to the unit, and there you go. Now I've checked and fixed my whole story for this particular project with the help of, of our new graph rules.